Every beat of my heart, every song that I sing, every prayer that I pray, every offering I bring, in every thought that I have, every word that I say, oh, be glorified. Yeah, yeah. From the start of each day till the end of Well, there are a lot of factors, uh, as I said. Um, some of these men get into relationships with women who are clearly out of their league. Okay. And especially if a woman now becomes the main breadwinner, okay. breadwinner in quotes, of, okay. uh, of the family, then she begins to treat the man not all women, mind you, just yes. the, the few. Yeah. Because yeah. Uh, I'm not too sure of the statistics for men, okay. but I imagine it's not that mm. great yeah. yet. Okay. Uh, so these women who feel that they're, after all, they're the ones uh, providing for the family, mm -hmm. 
now feel that they can treat their husbands anyhow. Oh, so sad. Because uh, it's, well, that's <laughs> how it is. Well. They say it's who pays the bike for dictates the tune. Yeah, that is it. Yeah. So, but how can they get help? Well, I think men have to be more forthright and okay. more open okay. and come out and, and to save their own lives because what happens in abuse is it, it graduates. Okay. It graduates. It doesn't stop. It just gets worse mm. if people don't get proper help. Mm. Unfortunately, the churches are not addressing this mm. issue. Mm. The way to get help, the quickest way okay. I know, is for people to approach their pastor. Okay. Their pastors or their imams or whoever they feel is their religious leader. Okay. At least get it out there okay. that you're having this issue mm -hmm. at home. Okay. Women tend to respect pastors a lot. Yes. And that is the reason I go to pastor first. Yes. As opposed to going to, to their parents or, or yeah, going yeah, yeah, to the true. family or oh, okay. to their counselors out yeah. there. Yeah. They, in Nigeria, we believe that mm, everything is just that, about God. That, so yeah. if that is so, if we want to key into that belief, then the first port of call mm. is to the family pastor okay. or the family imam okay. and have the person intervene. Okay. If it gets beyond that, then it's getting into the criminal zone. Okay. The man has a duty to report okay. to the local police okay. what he's going through wow. for record purposes. Okay. Yeah, because sometimes we've heard uh, stories recently mm -hmm. of women stabbing their husbands, yeah. killing their husbands, uh, emasculating them, the removing their male organs. Yeah. I don't know the full story. I don't know what pushes a woman mm -hmm. to such extent. Mm -hmm. But I know that it did not happen in a day. Yes. There would have been series and sequence of events mm. that now uh, crescendo to yeah, the so man losing yeah. his life. Yeah. So any man in an abusive relationship, now please go for mm -hmm. help mm -hmm. and also let it be on record okay. that you are facing this situation. Okay, thank you very much for joining me. Mm -hmm. And thank you so much for enlightening us. I think we've learned more from, from this um, little episode today. Until I come your way next time, I'm still Otitonia. Bye. <laughs>